When I say I'm not obligated to the limitations of what passes for intelligence these days, have you seen corporate intelligence? Wide-eyed old ladies waiting for to see if I make the cut. I got Canadians following me around, raping people, lady. Could I uh, speak to your supervisor? I'm not asking anybody to fall on their sword. A child molester's life is forfeit to begin with. I haven't found out the degree of damage and inconvenience that this has caused someone. I mean, is it unreasonable to ask, to expect a, a man to do whatever is convenient to remedy the situation? If the answer is no, I don't want to go to prison, why would I be talking to you? Have we done business, Dingleberry? If you're one of these felons that corporate can just pull out and throw back in prison whenever they want. You're only going to get yourself in more trouble. I have legit business with the democracy. I didn't do anything wrong. How you would be implicated otherwise? Sticking your nose where it doesn't belong. Other than that. Did I say something that cost somebody money? Because it wasn't in court. It wasn't under oath. Your gripe is with whoever's committing industrial sabotage. Maybe we're mutually affected parties doesn't make us co-conspirators. Do you go around poisoning little American kids so the UN can take revenge by coming and poison more little American kids? Did they hire you to arrange for to scapegoat some retard? Cause, well, I guess they should have hired somebody smarter. My whole thing is this. What if you never had to become an unwashed asshole to begin with? Were it within your power, would you not choose to spare the next generation of American kids your fate? How much would it be worth to the American people? In fact, what if the shoe were on the other foot? There's a limit, but you can't force somebody to become a Christian against their will. We don't convert by the sword. We convert to the dust. It is not within the scope of human authority to ban uh, enhanced interrogation. <laughs> I love, personally, I love the Jews. The dumb Jew bankers to be shaking in their boots all i want is what's right and fair and best for everybody yada yada and so forth and so on should be lucrative